Just going to clean myself. I've gained some weight in a while. You have to eat all your food, okay, Mom? to wash your teeth please Shall I put the goldfish for you? You don't want the goldfish? Okay. Only the chips? Yes. Okay. Alright, so we take the goldfish out. I have to sign something for him. Okay, can't do it with one hand.
empty. Let's see. Wash some water back. And do that in the bathroom. I'm also gonna make some banana uh, oatmeal cookies for him to take to school this afternoon. get the banana peel out of the house when I take them downstairs to throw them on the garbage so it doesn't stay in the house all day and gather flies and stuff. I'll be gonna finish after I drop them off from school. That will be the base for the banana uh, for the oatmeal cookies. The next thing I'm going to put, it will be chia, a little bit of chia seeds. See, it's a good source of calcium and iron. I'm probably going to put two or three spoons of that. I'm going to put a little bit of uh, raisins. And this is oats. Actually, my one's finished. I have to open this. Um, put it in this container. I use my old whey protein container to put it. See, mine is almost finished. So I'm gonna open that one. I'm gonna open this, put it in there it, for easy access. And this is also oats that I grind, I blended to have the flour consistency. So last time I made the, the oatmeal cookies, I grind a couple of them and put it in this container. So I'm going to pause the camera, get some stuff done. And I have to take the kids to school and a few. Okay, I just pour it. There's this. This is the empty container when I take the kids down. It's going to go in the garbage. So, oh my god, the kids are making so much noise. Alright, so I'm going to put the sea chia seeds first. A couple of spoons. Okay, I put six spoons of this in here. Just six spoons. And now I'm gonna mix them together. And I'm gonna pause the camera again while I do that. And then the next ingredient that I'm gonna put will be, uh, what is it? The oats. Regular oats and grounded oats. It's very important some earlier I don't know if I'm gonna show it this is mine this one has uh, protein powder and stuff like that it's not for the school it's not for the school this one is for me before I go work out and these 
other one that I made, the first batch that I made for the school. And uh, some of it came out burnt. So I decided to, I'm gonna leave the stove on. So I decided to make them over. So let me let it warm up and then I'm gonna use the same pan to make the new ones that I'm making right now. So back to the ones for the school. So I put my other ingredients. Now, this is uh, regular oats. No, not regular, grounded oats. I uh, used the regular oats and ground it and, uh, on the, uh, in the blender. This blender, uh, how do you call it? Magic something. Um, I don't, my camera, I'm using my cell phone. My camera broke. My husband ran over it <laughs> with a scroll by mistake. I think one of the kids uh, dropped it and someone saw it and held it for us. And when she, he saw me, he gave it to me. So now this is grounded oats to have the flour consistency. I don't know if I'll put the first, uh, the first uh, batch that I did. It really good it just came out a little bit burnt so I can't bring it to the school so I decided to make new ones and I think I'm gonna show the video when I went to the store and buy new bananas and I make new ones so I might show little clips of the first batch because I started making it before the kids went to school and uh, it came out burnt I think I had put the uh, stove a bit too high and I thought I put it at 350 and uh, the first batch sort of burnt but it's still good actually I ate some on my way to the store to buy new bananas do you have excuse me do you have do you have softer ones that's like almost like you guys really want to throw away Cause these, I want like very soft one. Oh, oh, That's all you have. Yeah. That's all you have. Okay. Yeah, sorry. No problem. It's really, really good. But I can't bring it to the school. So I'm gonna pause. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna pause it um, to add some more. And when I put the other oats, I'll show it. Uh, I'm gonna put the regular oats, the non-grind and uh, grinded one. Even though it's in the whey protein container, it's just that I use the container to put the oats for easy access. You see, regular oats. I'm gonna put not too much, just to have the texture of the oats, because the grounded one is uh, is sufficient enough. But I like to put that also to have the texture of the oats when you chew the cookies so that's about it and I'm gonna mix it and see if I need some more rounded uh, oats but otherwise this is it that's the cookies and I'm gonna put it on the pan and uh, that's it okay uh, let's see is it zoom okay it was zooming too much okay this is the dough for the cookies that's about it so I have regular non-grinded grounded oats and grounded oats and uh, bananas of course, see, uh, chia seeds, what else, uh, raisins and uh, what else do I put in there? I put vanilla extract, ground cinnamon, baking powder and that's it. So I hope uh, nobody gets sick. I try to avoid bringing food to the school. I never volunteer, but for some reason I volunteered yesterday. The thing that I was, I was gonna buy it actually. I was gonna buy uh, Chinese cookies because my son is half uh, Asian, but uh, someone suggested make this instead and I thought about it and I was like, you know, I don't know what ingredients they put on the, uh, they will be putting on the uh, cake. So I decided to make this to bring to the school. And hopefully this batch come out good. I do not have energy to make it to start all over again. So let me put it in the pan. Okay, 
there's 22 in this one 22 small ones the first batch i made them slightly too big so i put this here care 300 do not burn please come out good so i'm gonna prepare the next pan these i need to take them out i'm not gonna bring them to school but they're really good i'm gonna eat that one it's really really good but i'm not gonna bring this one let me pause okay i prepare um the next pan and this is how much i have left i have a lot So here, this one has 13 in there, I'm going to put it in the stove. Okay, the other one seems to be cooking fine. Okay, now I need to get the next pan ready. This one is the one that I made for myself, which has uh, 14 powder in it. And this one is definitely not going uh, to the school. So I'm going to put it away and get this pan ready for the next batch and I still have these left okay the next batch is on the way it's the first one I don't know how many this one gonna hold okay here we go Okay, let me see. Four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty. All right, let's make room. Shit, it's not gonna close. Okay, where is the thing? Let's see how this one is, so I could put it on top with the smaller one. This one needs to be at the bottom. Turn this way. almost done I have no more pen and I have this amount left either I wait until the other ones are finished let me see what I have here to put them this I have this left I'm gonna wash it so put it in there okay you just finished washed it I am going to dry it one hand cannot do it. That's olive oil in there. Okay, and I'm gonna put the uh, rest of the uh, oatmeal. Hopefully it takes, it takes it, because I don't wanna, that's too small. Oh, I need my hand, both hands to do it. And there it is, I was able to make four out of them. The rest, is there a spot for it? Uh, that is the question. Shit, the thing is hot. <laughs> Almost burned my hand. Ah. Spot. Ah, I'll put it on the side like this. I'll check on it later. Alright, that's about it. Clean up the farm. See, the thing is that as I'm... Um, one thing I like to do, as I'm cooking, I like to clean. So half of my stuff already cleaned put everything away as I'm using them so there's the this one is the one that I normally that would be for me this one has uh, the whey protein and some other uh, supplements I put the supplements on the cookies because sometime after a workout I have no energy to cook whatsoever so if I have the cookies and I have all the supplements in there that will be that will be good for me and I don't need to do anything extra. So that's it. I'm going to clean this. And then when I take it out of the stove, I will show you guys.
too much. Now I have enough cookies. For almost three weeks, I'm eating some cookies right now. Mama, let's go. So this one is the one with the uh, protein, and this is the one I was gonna bring to the store. Oh, it melted the thing. Shit, I put it over here next to the vent. It melted. But anyway, it's mine anyway. I'm gonna eat it. I'm not gonna bring it to the store. And this, this ball here, I'm gonna bring it to my youngest son's teacher. She saw me when I came back from the supermarket. So I told her what uh, what I'm doing. So I'm gonna bring this for her to taste. And uh, these are gonna go in the fridge. I have to change the bag. I like to keep the bread, the whole wheat bread um, bag for things like this. Cause um, I like to use, uh, when I make the protein, uh, the cookies, I like to put them in the uh, bag and then put them in the fridge. So I like to keep the, those um, bags for that. Okay. I switch the bag. This is going in the garbage. And this is going in the fridge for me. Put the other one in already. So I have enough cookies for very, uh, I don't know. Sometime I go, um, I'm hungry, so I'll just probably just eat them. So I have enough cookies for a while. And I still have more uh, bananas. So whenever, once they get a little bit very soft, when they get too soft, if the kids doesn't uh, don't eat them right now, like this, I'll just uh, make cookies out of them. So I have enough uh, bananas for a while now. Cookies for a while. Okay, so I'm wrapping up the one I'm bringing to my son's class. Not the older one. The older one, I'm making the cookies for him. That's for his school. That's two different school. This one is for my youngest son. I saw his teacher uh, when I came back from the supermarket. And... Um, I told her what I was doing. The, the teachers are very friendly. You, you could talk pretty much about anything with them. So I'm bringing that for her to taste. Just for. That's it. Checking the stuff. Oh my god, it's so hot in here. them for a little longer maybe I might even turn off the stove and let it cook well. ah, okay almost done the cookies I think they're done So much better now. Much, much better. There it is. There's no burning. That was make sense. Much, much better. Sort of make them small, but what matters right now? They're not burnt. Yay! Probably have maybe I don't know, maybe forty of them. Yep. much better it's still hot you know even though it's good this one I'm gonna keep I turn off the stove already but I'm gonna keep these this one in particular in there to get that heat this is perfect stuff a 
little bit. Okay, got it. One hand. Four, eight. Oh, this one. Eight. Ten. Twelve. Fourteen. Sixteen. Eighteen. Twenty. Twenty-two. Twenty-four. Twenty-six. Twenty-eight. Thirty. Thirty-two. Thirty-four. Thirty-six. Thirty-eight. Forty. Let's see. Let me just count. Forty. Forty-two. Forty-four. Forty-six. Forty-eight. Fifty. Fifty-two. Fifty-three. Fifty-three. Not bad. Not bad at all. Cookies, and then once they finish warm up, this is the fork that I used when I was using the first batch. They were kind of sick. I'm gonna put it in this. Nothing fancy. So that's it. Okay, the cookies are done. I wash my hands. Okay. That's two. Finally, it came out. Okay. okay, you know what? Let me. I'm gonna taste the smaller one. I'm tasting this one. The only thing is that it's a little bit hard, but it tastes good. So it's based on people's opinion. If they don't eat it. I'll be more than happy to come back home with it. to the school later on in the afternoon and I'm making myself another cup of coffee and that's the oatmeal cookies